Welcome back, everybody. Some more everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. Green Country Club today. Regular tees, teeny cups, club skill high. You know the drill. Let's see what we can do on here. It's a par four. So par four to get us going. A little bit of wind. All about the approach shots. You should be able to score well on green if you can get them close. There's a few interesting greens. See what I did there. Um, but it's not the hardest course in the world. But then again, it's not Eagle City. Okay, I'd love a chip in though. Never seem to get it on this hole. There we go. Start with the birdie. Best way to start. So we've got 18 under with the customs on here. That's not bad actually with TD Cups. But I think they're, they're all birdieable to some degree. Or at least if you're accurate, they should be. You might miss one or two, you might pick up some eagles, but 18's got to be the target, hasn't it? So 180 left. Wow, oh, we've got a nice pinto. Sometimes you get up in here, and it's really hard to get at. So zero excuses today. Ah, oh, my worries is going to just drop too short and it'll kill it when it bounces on the fairway. I should have known that. Oh, feels bad. We're just going to have to chip this in then. That's the only solution to this problem. Oh! <laughs> Teeny cups. Teeny cups. I mean, I know I've got a birdie. But that was a... Nice Eagle for sure. Two under. Move along, everybody. Three. Pins at the back, which is kind of nice. Bit of a long shot there. It's a big old four iron. We're on the money. Did we read the wind? Sometimes I under-read these longer... Yeah, I always do this. I under-read the longer clubs. They're shorter and the wind takes them further. Don't know what it is. This is a tough birdie part. Missed it. Missed it. See, it's why I needed the eagle on the last one. Feels bad. Nice part. My Garen Jesus doesn't love me today. It's a powerful... right. I mean, you can play the power shot here, but it's not really going to help you. Go. Ooh, slightly worried. I've outdriven myself here. No, I think I'm okay. That's a chip over that bunker and up onto the green. That's two. We've got to, we can't leave 12 foot. We've got to get him inside the second circle. Got to get him in sort of seven, six, seven feet. Ah, oh, I missed that one as well. Mm. Right, come on. Got to get these approaches better. Two pars in a row is not acceptable. It's a five. Question really of how much you want to cheat it. I mean, you can't hit it even further right and rely on the downslope to kick you even further. It's about as much as I usually take. Should leave me about 80. There you go. I know that shot well. That's more like it. Six foot, that second circle, and even then it's tough. Looks like it slopes up. 
But at least you're giving yourself a chance. Got it. And that's what we're trying to do. That's the pattern. So six is another path. Oh, this is the super straight one, isn't it? Oh, missed it. That's going to be wet. Oh, I'm not sure I wanted the drop, if I'm honest. But there you go. Didn't get the flyer, which was worrying me a little bit. Well, we'll get a putt for par. Stay calm, there. You can do it. uphill. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. Oh. I can feel I'm gonna have to come back and do this again. This is not a great round, is it? Is a par three. But again, you'll miss an impact every now and again. You just gotta fight it off. Oh, good shot. <laughs> again, short. Got the birdie though. Back to three under. You're incredible. Oh, eight. It's a path. Eight's a bit of a weird one. You kind of there's no point playing the power shot, but you always seem to want to do it. It's that little dip in the fairway. At about two sixty. You just want to make sure you get past it. There you go. So a hundred left. Huh? I've got a bit of air under it. Go for the leaving, just leaving too much. Sloping uphill. I mean, good part and all, but got to stop leaving those. Nine. You can hit this as hard as you like because you won't make the water. Oh, keep rolling. So, 170 to go. A little bit too much, but that's okay. You'd take seven foot for an eagle. Well, I needed that, didn't I? I got me to six under. Some sort of respectability. Ah, that three, four, five, six stretch. Actually, going back to two. Should have got the eagle on two. Three was a bad shot. Four was a bad shot. Six was a missed impact. Right. Enough of that. Second half. Wipe the slate clean. Give it some air. Let it blow it downwind. There you go. Get down the hill. Ah, not quite. It's a 92 to go. It's going to pitch right when it lands. Good line there, just, just eight foot too long. This is a tricky part. Yeah, like Focus. So we're gonna start with a par. Not what I was looking for. Then again, teeny cups, you see. 
makes it hard. You gotta get it close. And I'm just not getting close enough. Off you go. Masterful. That's a better tee shot. 80 to go. Uh, just a little bit long. Need it, need it, got it. Really downhill par three. Not my favourite hole. But what can you do? Got to play the course. It's gone way left. Look at that. Well, I've had more difficult parts. Hard to know how much to bring this one back, to be fair. Not quite. Oh. I gave it every chance. Just gonna have to take the par. You know how we feel about pars. Seven under. It's 13. Again, I'm pretty sure you can't get it up here. Give it a go, though. Go on, then. Masterful. Don't take your eye off <laughs> you get it to the rough, it turns out. All right. Someone asked me why I use the nine iron so much. It just sits better when you use these little chips, as you'll see. That's bouncy. It kind of it bounces and then settles, and acts more like a putt, which is what you really want. That was pretty good. Whereas the approach wedge, it's so bouncy. Eight under. That was slightly better. It's a 14 again. Not the most diff shot in the world. All about the second shot here. So what have we left ourselves? 160. Angle's not bad. It's going to pitch left when it lands. Let's just give it a little bit of room. Ah, just got the fairway which kills it. It's an eagle part, but it's a tricky one. No, low. Only just though. Just needed a touch more power, I think, really. The line was not bad. <laughs> That's twice. Teeny cups. I'd say some bad words, but it doesn't, it's not going to get that shot back. That should have been an eagle. Oh, some days, some days it just doesn't run for you, and you've just got to muscle through. Do what you can. You watch, I'll play Balata next, and I'll just get a blinding round where I everything will drop there'll be hole in ones today's not that day so 100 left a little bit uphill a little bit into the wind nothing major that'll do me that's a tricky part as well It just kicks a little bit, doesn't it? Nine under, three, four, five, finish. Sixteen. The little African green. See the way it slopes away to the left, slopes away to the right. Absolute nightmare. I have no tips other than to be super accurate. 
And all the left hand shots were in the world is not going to help me with that. Luckily, you get an uphill putt pretty much. An uphill putts are good because you can get my little bit of. You can give them a tiny bit of a leather in. No, 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 no. Bad putting doesn't help, does it? Wanted to throw that one out. It's a 17. Again, you can be massively bold here. In fact, you can play this line if you're feeling really daring. And it should, in theory, kick back on. No matter what you do, it should end up back on the fairway. There you go. Got a bit of roll as well. It's nice. So 71 to go. And this is a nasty little fairway. You do want to be close on this one. Nasty little green even. Oh, that's all right. I mean, why I'm playing a better shot because it's a nasty green when you should play the better shot even on the nice greens. But we got it. 10 under. It's 18. Uh, you can eagle this, but the second shot is an absolute beast on here. you got to hit usually a wood. Sometimes you can get away with the three iron. Depends on the wind. I think it's going to be a wood today. Two oh five. Oh, I might get away with the three iron. All right. Oh, neat shot. <coughs> Just get on the green. I'll be happy. Nope. All right. We're gonna need a chip them. No, nah, I was always low. Always low. Birdie chance, though. I don't think we're going to be 11 under. Oh, there was so much in that round. I mean, some of it was luck. Some of it was just bad shots. Just bad shots. So we went 6 under on the way out. 5 under on the way back. Could have done better. I don't think we missed many fair... Yeah. We didn't miss many fair. We didn't miss many creeds. It was just we weren't close enough. Show it doesn't give you kind of your average distance from the pin because I think that would have been significantly higher than in previous rounds. I just wasn't getting it close enough to make those putts tell. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a comment, and I'll see you next time for a bit more of Biddy's Golf.